Welcome everybody back to another bold cast reaction. I'm Lindsay. I'm Carson. And today we are watching Blue Lock episode three. Uh, last time things were just heating up more and more. We kind of found out the full scope of everything and how they're in teams and they're gonna have to compete and all about the monsters inside of people. And uh, yeah, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. You can check out our Patreon to get timer uncut reactions uh, that are quite a bit ahead. So yeah, please check that out. If you're watching on Patreon, thank you very much. We really, really, really appreciate it. And uh, let's just get into it. I'm deciding who will kind of play what. <laughs> well. One hour, he just has everything like super timed out. <laughs> That's not very many people. I guess they bring up penalty points because he just knows they're going to be beating the shit out of each other. <laughs> really starting a new world from zero out here. <laughs> It means you should be all just doing the same thing and trying to score and being selfish and not caring if you're playing defense. You should just leave your team wide open and go and score. <laughs> if you can. The, the way that this field is made is really intense as well, like <laughs> with just the concrete. Actually, that kind of reminds me of Squid Game too, like how they're just, like how it's all like all inside, yeah. like in, in rooms and stuff. I just realized it's kind of weird. I mean, I guess we got a game kind of at the start of the first episode, but we haven't really got soccer in this yeah. is the third episode. <laughs> but as you see, everything is actually about soccer. That's true. Life is about soccer. Can only go up from here. Or, yeah. <laughs> or fail. Get taken away immediately. <laughs> You gotta be selfish. <laughs> Quit talking about Yeah, why is why is everything stopping? What are the other guys doing right now? This is American football now, they stop every two seconds. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> what is the other team doing? <laughs> yeah, what what is the other team? Okay, good. Oh, the infighting. Jeez. This is where you need to play as a team because... You have to play as a somewhat of a team. Yeah. Jesus. Take it from him. <laughs> what you is know, that zoo? I, I believe him. <laughs> Shohei. Sneaky. No. He's too good. Yeah. This is also the problem with the the goal as well, like, yeah. You might as well just ha leave an open net, yeah. honestly. <laughs> A spherical servant. <laughs> King. This guy's acting real cocky for being in the second worst <laughs> team. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like they need to work together in a team, but like in a different way, like kind of take turns, but like still be keeping it away from the other team at the very bare minimum. Yeah. It's getting all psyched out. <laughs> you 
idiot. Uh, yeah, and if we lose the game... You. Oh, God. Yeah. I wonder if he's gonna be like, yeah, actually, even the winning team, you lose. Go, go, go die. <laughs> you lose. Yeah. You're all kicked out. Mm. Mm, send someone else. No. See, like, it's at the end of the day, it's still a team sport. You can't 1v11. Oh. 1v22 or 21. Because you're versing your own team as well. Hmm? Well, right now it's two. <laughs> and that's how soccer developed over the years as well. <laughs> like, that's why it's played the way that it's played. Because this was happening. <laughs> Game over. Da. Shit. Really? Yeah, well, if you think like that, you have. Come on. Well, you better freaking try. Let's go. Mm -hmm. I love how they do their eyes like that. Yeah, me too. Get it. If he doesn't get Is somebody it. else gonna come? <laughs> Don't think about it. Let's quit stopping. Punch him in the face. For the same position. Yeah. Hmm. What? He actually passed it? Oh shit! Ooh. Well, alright then. Nice. It's a one. It got in! Why are you fighting it? He just automatically did it. <laughs> It was good, it, it, it was faked him out, and they got a goal. Or you... He made the choice that got the goal, though. Is, yeah. the, is the important decision. He made the split second decision to pass to the guy who got it. That's not worth nothing. I don't even 
understand why this like this guy's getting mad just for his own personal thing, but like yeah. the other guy would be getting just as mad if he passed to him, you know? Yeah. I think orange hair guy, Bachira, and Isagi are gonna be the or wait, is it three from each it's three it's one from each of the teams. I can't remember. I forget. Oh, next game. Yeah, I, maybe it's at the end of this whole tournament. Which means you have to play soccer like it's fucking soccer, not like it's... <laughs> <laughs> Exactly. This is the whole point. You have to work together. あいつの言ってることが全部正しいとは思ってないよ。<笑> It means we play soccer. It's just a, it's just about understanding the game from the ground up because they've been working off the backs of like however many years of and however many people like deciding how the game is played. But when you break that down, you have to build it back up and you get a better understanding. Mm -hmm. mm. It's actually about the whole team. <laughs> Are there cameras in here? <laughs> Jesus. See, at least you got one. <laughs> How is he creating holograms in his hand? <laughs><笑><笑> Did she pre-record this or is he doing this on the fly? <laughs> How much of the show is him doing these speeches in front of a Japanese flag? <laughs> The voice actor for this guy got paid so much, he's top billed in this show. 
Bam bam. Great episode once again. I do, I just love the guy. He's like has catch you in a baseball, but then it like disappears from <laughs> nothing. I'm like, okay, there's a few options here. Either he pre-recorded this, sent it off to someone, and he and they <laughs> there's and a they, whole production they edited it for every type of situation. Like he just predicted anything that could happen. He has a video ready for it. The other option is that he is paying a bunch of people to on the fly edit in anything and just like read his mind and edit in anything that he's saying live like he he just acts like he's catching a ball and they have like a couple of seconds to like edit that in <laughs> oh my god and like photoshop in the flag behind him and everything like it's just him standing next to a green screen or they have actually developed technology with the ability <laughs> it's to, AI. To, to create a ball that will then fade into nothing. Uh, it doesn't just fade just, into nothing. It, it like explodes into holograms yeah. and shit. And they have developed this technology just to inspire yeah. the, the guys in this, uh, this uh, blue lock. Uh, yeah, I, I just love how the, the, he's <sighs> like, start from zero and then they're just like, Okay, let's pick the exact positions as everyone has before, okay? Okay, and then, but then at the same time, let's all just abandon all of that and uh, do whatever we want. Yeah, it's, it's, I think it's basically, it's just a very drawn out way of saying what we kind of figured out in the first two minutes <laughs> is that it, it's, you know, it, it's, it's the game and they were working off of assumptions and like, the idea is to break down your, con your the conventions and everything and make you understand them so that you, you know, form yeah. the, you arrive in a similar place. But if you're just doing a script of what people have told you and how you've learned based on what other people have learned, then you're not, then you're not actually conscious about the decisions that you're mm -hmm. making. So breaking it down and, and, and doing the math yourself of like the multiplications, the a team is greater than the sum of its parts. Um, Figuring that out firsthand in this situation and use and using that information to adapt yeah. is what's going to you know provide the best experience. And so that's all this is. It's a beginning thing. So you know it makes sense and everything. And it's and it's all the thing of like, you know, you're not going to be the top. No one on your team is going to be the top scorer if at least if no one on your team is scoring. Yeah. Like, you know. It's better to have, like, okay, you have your strongest player. He scores more than anyone else, but at the same time, other people are now getting the chance to score mm -hmm. because of him. Yeah. Um, and that, and that, and that's like the whole, that's like the whole thing. And, and like they were thinking, oh, maybe he's just lying and it's not just the top scorers from each team. He and lied about, like, you yeah, maybe it's just the best teams, the be the people who, can actually figure out what they're doing and actually like try some new stuff and you know you don't maybe everyone doesn't need to be just locked into playing the same positions the entire game maybe things are more flexible maybe you know you some people might need to stay back or if you can figure out how to overwhelm the other team and throw them off then you know your positions don't become as important yeah. as long as you're working together in some type of way no matter what that way is if it's an, if you find a new way of working together then that's just fine but you still do have to work together or nothing yeah. will happen i think that there's i think it's possible there's still some information that he's keeping because he did keep the thing of like oh just so you know the pre the people who leave will never be able to play for Japan. Yeah, you'll never have a chance. Your career is basically over. Yeah. So, and, but he waited till after to say that, and then so like if, if if this was going to be the thing, why even have the tag game in the first place? Why have this thing yeah, just where to why three hundred people? From each team? Why three hundred people, and why not just start with two seventy five and do this team thing? Well, it's because they're trying to. He put the fear in them in the beginning to make them afraid, so that they would you know, come to the conclusions that he's laid out for them and follow this train. Mm -hmm. If they didn't, if they did, weren't taking it as seriously, or if they didn't see somebody who's, uh, you know, in each of their things, it, him, if they didn't see uh, uh, Jipachi say, you're done, get out, that's it. Yeah. Then they would be playing a lot differently. They would be thinking about this a lot differently. So I think it's possible that, you know, maybe th they leave and then they're like, okay, like you could still play, do whatever you want, or it, or maybe, it, but you can't contact them. Like stay away, and and they're just that's why it's keeping them locked in is to keep them from the information that you know it's not as serious. Or maybe with with the eventual thing, what I'm getting at is at the end, 
you know, it's more than one person. It is like a team. Well, at, at the, the end, end, they did say the like the top five would like. At the very end, it's one. Yeah. At but the very think, end, it I is think, one person. I think it was at like the top five. They could like, like I don't think that they were banned forever. If you oh, get into the top five, I missed that part. I think we could double check, or they probably explain it later or whatever. Yeah. Anyway, it's um, the the idea is one person wins, everybody else loses. But yeah. I think it's possible that uh, there's more to that than meets the eye, and yeah. they're and they're just it's all about the pressure. It's all about putting the pressure because they this guy's making a big big deal about like how so focused on the team and focusing on the collective like Japanese the the one uh, all Everyone's all staying over in their all line, together yeah and keeping it in yeah so but, so you don't have that selfish thing but and they I want wonder, to create that environment imagine so. if they like they could even be like oh yeah it's just like one guy going through but then at the end be like actually this whole team is going through and we're just going to try a team yeah. that has like no other formal positions and you're just gonna go and see if you can throw all the other teams off. Like, you know what I mean? I, it's I, possible. It's possible. They, they can they can kind of do anything. And they were saying like, yeah, this thing that we've been doing and the thing that's got us this far is gonna die anyway. Like that girl was saying in that press release. Yeah. Like, it's not just like, oh, we're gonna add something new into this already solid thing. It's like the whole thing Yeah, they were talking scrapped. about like, burn, burn everything, burn the past let the boy die or you know kill the kill the boy and let the man be born or let the man live or whatever the saying is yeah that so i i think that's that's possible and maybe that's why in the ending there's like a, a focus on the team it might just be because this is this part of the story and, and these are the guys the we're team, dealing with yeah but um and i i doubt everybody here is going to like make it to the very end but it might be that yeah they're actually crafting like five yeah like you said five people who will go and the top will be like the starter but mm -hmm. uh, the rest of them will be like back up or playing yeah. different positions or, or, or like they yeah, just breaking pull the down whole the position. team and be like yeah these all this is the entire new team Japan yeah and they're and all kick just, everybody else out. we're gonna w win by just like overwhelming the other teams yeah. and not defending ourselves at all mm -hmm. um, or maybe know. by the end they'll learn those those abilities and everything because yeah. they're kind of learning or teamwork all just from be the ground like, up all here flexible. it's yeah it's it's hard to say because the guy is so over the top. And, like it's hard to say like if there are if that if it, if it should just be taken at face value which is fine and I'm still cool with mm -hmm. or if there's going to be another trick yeah. somewhere along the way this is it's it's I'm finding like a lot of parallels this is a lot like the Stanford prison experiment where <laughs> do you know about that in case you don't know there's an experiment that is banned that that is like a famous thing that that gave a lot of data to uh, the field of psychology where bunch of people were in a college and they were paid like whatever $20. This is in like the 90s, I think. And there was a, the psychology professor there was doing research and he he paid all these students to, you know, take the position of guard and he made a fake prison on the campus. And like some people were the guards, some people were the prisoners. And then basically just like make them do what, what guards and prisoners would do. Like you follow the schedule and then it was measuring just what what would happen when people are given that authority. And what happened was people were absolutely poisoned by it and just like it brought out a different side of people. It brought out like a monster and gave a lot of people PTSD that they still, that some of them still live with today. And it totally shocked their system. And, and because of that, I think the guy lost his license to do research. Um, but it's uh, it's it's a it's like a famous case, and it's kind of the same thing here. It's just the putting the immense, crazy psychological pressure. When at the end of it, it doesn't matter, and you get out, and it doesn't matter. But like, uh, it's it's all about creating like the circumstance to to facilitate an outcome, yeah. and that seems like what this guy's trying to do is is it's it, it maybe we don't know how much of what he's saying is legit, but we, you have to believe it because that's the point, and that's yeah. how you're going to make it through. Also, how many letters are in the alphabet? Aren't there 26? 26. Yeah, then why is it a team Z if there's only 25 teams? We'll find out <laughs> on the next episode of Blue Lock. Leave a like and subscribe. Check out Patreon right now to keep us alive and keep our cats fed. Thank yes. you very much for all your support in this tough time. Much love. See you next one, I'm Carson. I'm Lindsay. Bye-bye.